This is really a call to action. We are opening the doors and saying it's just not government. You look at the size of this group of people. All who have in common that they love it here in Howard County and they want to make it a great place. These conferences aren't about a bunch of people that are just talking because it does change lives. The conference is the Champions of Change and this is what we're hoping to become an annual event. The goal is to build on collaboration and networking and to be able to prevent homelessness and to understand why people you know become homeless and know that it's not just one size fits all. And in order to make effective change we know that we need to have multiple voices heard. We need to have people from all walks and disciplines at the table. How can you have a discussion about helping to make my life better when you have no clue what's going on in my life. So instead of having a bunch of people speak for us, they allow us to speak for ourselves. You get into a room like this and you hear people say, but we didn't know it existed. We didn't know that those services were here. Then we know we have work to do. It is tremendously pleasing and heartwarming to see the room so full today and to see the energy. It's a wonderful mixture of people coming together. And they're all part of this disparate puzzle and we need to take the puzzle and put it together. And this is a great way to do that. There's a lot of diversity of uh, ideas, but also bring those diversity together to partner and work through those things as well. So many opportunities. There's so many wonderful speakers here that offer a wealth of information in regards to every service area within Howard County. With this particular workshop, she gave some practical applications and what it helped me realize is that People are not broken, but systems are. It really allows us to build that puzzle and develop a fuller picture of the needs and the resources to address it. And so this conference is just the beginning of us having those conversations, but also the beginning of really putting down some concrete steps, some concrete agreements with one another. We are here because we not only want to make change, we want to make the agencies and politicians make change that can further help people along. Probably the most important thing that I've taken out of it so far is that we have an obligation to evaluate policies with a lens towards equity, in particular racial equity and racial justice. They're actually interested in what we have to say and changing the policies and making things better. So that by the time we come back together, a year from now, we will not only have solutions, but we'll also have some opportunities to talk about what's next. Everyone needs to come to a conference like this. I want to definitely thank the county and the county government for allowing this opportunity. It's really, really a powerful conference, so I definitely encourage you to come. I will be here next year. <laughs> it's exciting for me. It's energizing me, and it's giving me a lot of takeaways. And so I think there's a lot of great work to do. It may be hard. That's okay, but we actually can do this. We can make a difference, even if it's just one day at a time, we will be able to make a difference.